Yum, yum! William Vaughn here with a quick introduction to creating a shadow catcher in Moto. In this scene, I've placed an image in the environment with a projection type set to front projection. I've set the texture camera to the default camera in the scene. We can see that the mesh item appears to be sitting in the image, but there's no shadow being cast from the item onto the ground surface. That is because there's no geometry to cast a shadow on. Create a flat polygon to use as a shadow catcher and assign a material to it. Add a shader layer to the shadow catcher's material group and change the alpha type to shadow catcher. When you assign a material a shader with the alpha type set to shadow catcher, all of the material's attributes are invisible and the surface will exclusively render shadows cast by direct and indirect illumination. It'll appear that nothing has changed. This is because the base shader is sitting at the top of the shader tree and is overriding the shader that we've created. Drag the shadow catcher material group above the base shader to complete the setup. If you don't want the shadow catcher to also be reflective, simply adjust the material attributes. Oh, look at the time.